Good evening. Good evening. We're back with a. Uh, we've had a lot, an awful lot of, um, awful lot of requests. One we? in particular, Rob. One in particular, the first one, in fact. To do with uh, our products displayed on the table at the moment. Uh, Mr. DJ XL asked if we could uh, um, try faggot and chips. Uh, and could we find it in Iceland? And uh, could we find it for a pound? No. We found it in Iceland, but a little bit more than a pound. So how much was it, Rob? One pound for the uh, six faggots. So that uh, is a pound. That's a pound. Yeah. This is a little bit more. Ah, I say, how much was that one? One pound seventeen or something. So yeah, it's a, it's a meal for two. Not looking forward to this review, must admit. I've never had a faggot in my life. Really? What? What is a faggot? What's a faggot? What? What? It's a pork. What? what it's what? a pork meatball. Is it seasoned? Is it pork just meatballs? meatballs? Yeah, it's a meatball. Why is it a faggot then? Why isn't it meatballs? That's what it's called. It's a specific kind of meatball. West Country sauce, sixty-two percent. Sixty-two percent sauce. Well, sauce. It comes in the gravy. Look. All oh, right. <laughs> pork faggots. These are. That'd be pork. Guess how? What? Guess what? The percentage is. Pork. It's guess pork. What, pork. Yeah. Guess what percent pork it is. Uh Sixty-nine percent. Seventy percent. Add it just then. Very small writing. What was it? Oh my god! It's a breakdown of the pork. Oh my god, pork rind, pork liver. How much percentage is it? I tell you what, let's just stop reading. Why did you ask me when there's no answer? <coughs> Spicy peppery meatball in their gravy. Or West Country sauce. But there is a percentage, Rob. There is, yeah. Yeah. 38 or something. 19%. And that is your whole stuff of, that makes up the pork, like pork liver, pork fat, rusk. 19%. Oh, am I getting that wrong? Or is it? Oh no, no, I am getting it wrong. GC. Yeah, I, I, my, is that thirty-eight percent? You so many glasses. So thirty-eight percent, thirty-eight percent is the pork. Pork faggots. It's not really that interesting. They're a pound. Is it thirty-eight percent pork faggots and sixty-two percent sauce? That would make that's sense, wouldn't it? That's hundred percent. What? Do that yeah, again? That's right. No, it's still loud. Yeah, don't do that again. So we have six pork faggots, four portions of. McCain quick chips. Oh, we're going to go with McCain there, but not Mr. Brains here. We can't be, you know, I don't want to advertise either of them. Oh, okay, so Mr. Brains. It's yeah, obvious what it is. It says it. Right, shall we uh, have a look at these chips? Do you want to look at the cooking time for that? And I'll look at what? the cooking time for this. For this? This is easy. This is just cook for one minute, turn Mike. over, and let it cook for another minute, and then let it stand for another minute. Easy. I've got oh, this yeah, easy. It's, it's uh, to heat on four power two heat. Or full power. What's the two about? Where's one? <laughs> oh. One. Remove all the packaging. I'm not gonna put it in like that, am I? <laughs> Remove all the packaging and transfer faggots and sauce into a similar size microwavable dish. We're gonna need something different. Similar size to what? Now I, we know that there is indeed a dish that the faggots are inside. But I we we're privy to that information, but what if you didn't know there was a dish inside? And we're talking about a similar sized dish. Go and get a similar sized dish to what? what the, the, it's in a box. I don't know what's the in there. Are there right could there. be a suitcase in there. The and the packets are that big, you know? The instructions say number one. Yes, this is so, number one. So if you buy this, you think, what the hell is this? Mm. How am I going to cook this? And they say, okay, number one. Oh, well, I'll need to remove all the packaging and put it in the microwave of a bowl. Yeah, we ain't got through number one, though. This is still number one. But you want number two first. No, I'm not number two yet. Removing the faggots sauce into a similar size microwave plate uh, dish is still on number one. And still the same sentence, so it hasn't been a full stop. So um, I retain the right to be annoyed. We can right. deal with those instructions when it comes to. Do you want to know them now? No need to know them now. <clears throat> Obviously, at the rate you're going, it's going to take forever. These don't take very long. So, luckily, these are just, you just pop these in. So we're going to get cracking with this. Right. Can I open the box just and show the instructions? I'll do, I'll, I'll do that bit because we don't want to get it wrong. No. So here we go. Look, mic right, that's not ah, that's not microwavable. That's a metal container. See, that's why you can. Ah, that's like oven it. material, isn't you it? You can oven it. Now, so I remember from the instructions, we've got to remove this and put it in there. 
And it's, like, I see why you say similar size, but we can. How the f are you going to get out of here? I'm going to break the dish if I whack that. Don't whack it. Just wait for it to defrost a bit. It's not working, is it? There's a little bit of it come out. If, if it comes up now, it's going to smash everything. Uh. Right, so basically, you got to get physical with it. Why'd you do that? I look away. There you go. Oh, man. Look at that, man. That's like almost... I think we may have to break it a bit. I don't just, you know, on transferring... I'll tell you what. We've we'll got to hope it, it don't move. We'll put we? it in for the first section, and then it will just flop into the bowl. Like seven minutes. Seven minutes. Mix it up. Another six minutes. Let's get on with it. Mm. So, on with the cooking. Okay, so put the first in the microwave for the first stage of seven minutes and full power. And uh, hope for the best. Beep. Right, so you take it out halfway. Right, and then we, oh, it's all separated, look. We've got to stir that. It's quite crunchy in the middle still. Well then, we pop it back in for the hair uh, reminder. reminder. Alright, oh, it looks hotter than the sun. Alright, I'm gonna need something to pick that up first. Care and Look attention. You know that's cooked well when it's welded to the side of the plate there. Look at that. Let's take that to the table. Piping hot. Mother. Right, whilst we're here, let's pop those chips in, shall we? Now these fellas are going in for a bit of a shorter time. Going in for a minute. Just got to jiggle these about. They don't stick to each other, I think. And we pop these back in for the remaining time of 2 minutes 20 seconds. Right. Straight out of the oven, microwave oven. We've got two packages of chips here, six targets, which was going to be a first time for Justin here, eating, never, never tried them before. There you go, a bunch of chips. So again, this is a, you know, came in above the, uh, above the, the one pound limit, but this is feeding We've still feet. got the stick uh, to each other gold. That we get with microwave chips. They still stick together? Yeah. I can't actually. I've got to have some salt and vinegar on that. Alright, we're having gravy. You can have salt and vinegar on it if you want. That'll do. That'll do. I'm alright. <laughs> Half of them are yours. What do you think? That's a lot of food. Let's have a go. Let's dig in. I've had faggots before and they're damn tasty. They all are soft, it's almost like a jelly. <laughs> That'll do for the faggots. Ooh. The taste of the faggot was alright. It's just. It's mm. not bad. Well, I shouldn't be able to smush it like that. Should you? Is that what a faggot is? Should you be I able had to... this loads as a kid, I loved it. Look at that. The chips were basically. Well, they were cooked and they taste potato. Undone. Mm. You don't want to try anymore? Um, no. So you wouldn't, hang on, so would you recommend that? No, absolutely not. I like that, I like the flavour, the texture, you it's just not right, sure. it's like I'm jelly. Sure it's like it. jelly, I don't like the texture. Yeah. It it's... tastes good though. Chips, yeah. Microwave chips. They're just like chips you bought four hours ago. Yeah, I mean I wouldn't say it's a chip, What what's chippish about it? Looks like a chip. If you cooked it now properly, it would probably taste like a, it'd be like a chip. The only time a chip should not be crispy is from a chip shop. And in those cases, and we're talking English chip shops here, we're not talking fries, okay, Americans? It's a different thing. Uh, it, the only thing there is, you expect really soggy chips. I mean, I've tried to make chips in my fryer, like chip shop chips. I've tried to do it, I've tried to work it out how to do it, you know, use really old oil. 
from the chip shop. They're all been there for months. Doesn't work. Thicker chips, lower heat, doesn't work. That's the only time anyway you can get away with it. Crappy chip is. Anyway, I'm going off the point. I hope that was useful. <laughs> I would rate that four. Because if you really want to try get some chips, it would remind you of like. I'm going to say one. Even if I really wanted something to eat, <clears throat> there would have to be nothing else available for me to eat that. So I'll answer your this, question, I DJ XL. I wouldn't know. You can get it. If it's you a can good faggot, it. because I've not had a faggot before, but this particular meal. That wasn't the question ultimately. The question was, can you get it from Iceland? You can. And it's like just over two pounds to feed two people with two packets of extra chips in the freezer for another time. Would you ever try faggots again? Definitely. Because I, I want a reference point. Yeah, a meatball that just didn't have any co structural cohesion. Mm. The taste, though. If you get over the texture, taste, mwah, there you go. So soft, you could stab a soft chip into a faggot and it just fall apart. That's a hell of a presentation, isn't it? Mm. See you next week. Thank you uh, for watching. And if you have any uh, suggestions, <coughs> post them up and we'll, we'll uh, review them. Absolutely. Good evening and good night. Good evening and good night. Cheers.